If I could save time in a bottle The first thing that I'd like to do Is to save every day Till eternity passes away Just to spend them with you Billy Billy, Hello Hello, Ian Ian, McKellen McKellen, Billy Billy. <laughs> <laughs> It's difficult asking me what appeals to me about Shakespeare because he's such a huge part of my life. When I was eight years old I went to see my first Shakespeare play mm -hmm. and I enjoyed it. When I was at school I acted in his plays. When I was at university I acted in his plays. I went to see the plays. I, I began to see Shakespeare in movies by Laurence Olivier, the great actor of my youth. So by the time I started acting as a professional, uh, yes I did lots of new plays to begin with and, 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 and uh, classic plays but I found myself doing Shakespeare again so Shakespeare just a part of my life to, to inhabit those characters is not easy uh, and then you have the help of the language which is sublime but it's complicated and it's a little bit old fashioned and the actors have to absorb it and so that the audience is going to be able to understand it and appreciate it so for me, I think Shakespeare is not a philosopher, but a fellow professional, really. And I like the fact that he used to be an actor, because uh, I'm an actor, too. Mm. Okay, thank you. Coolest. Yeah, coolest. <laughs> you know, none of them are really cool. <laughs> no. They've all got, this is what I like about Shakespeare, all his characters have frailties. They've all got problems. They live life to excess. Too much emotion often. But cool Well, if you, if you get a character in Shakespeare who's cool, don't trust him. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> yeah. You know, just thinking about it, I've been asked a lot of these sort of questions when I've been in Shanghai for the film festival, and the, I realised that none of Shakespeare's characters are complete. They haven't arrived. They're on a journey. There's something yet to be done. They've got it wrong. They want to put it right. Or they don't want to put it right. They go through to the bitter end. There's a disaster. Somebody dies. They die. They leave the world a worse place. And sometimes at the end of the play, there's a character who arrives almost out of nowhere and takes over. Young man, usually. At the, end of, at the end of Hamlet, Fortinbras arrives. Will it be all right with him? At the end of Macbeth, um, Malcolm 